Oh. Bah. Oh god. Stop that. Now. What the? Bad. Bad makes Ziggy lose Jonathan. Beating your head against the wall won't change that. Bad hurt. Bad less thinky. Bad less thinky. Bad sadness. Don't seem to have trouble communicating with the troll. Why'd you bring me down here? Take note of that hole. We'll come back to it later. And see that door? Vault behind it until recently filled with Novigrad crowns and countless other valuables. But God! Then boom! Chorfun go! Translating into common, someone fucking made off with nearly 20 tons of my gold. And all the lighter stuff, and you will help me get it back. Hmm. Fine, I'll help you. You're not exactly burst witcher mutation. All right. I'm all. In. Take it. You're no. Oh. Boom. Boom. I'll elaborate. Gotten pretty. Lots of. <laughs> Bad mushrooms. Bad hop. Yeah. Not. Bart. Bart. Nah. Try to. Of course. What happened? Lads, try to. I vowed. Should have a few. You've not. List. Okay. Dandelion, what the hell have you gotten yourself into? Ah, so it was. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That I remember. Great. Explosion crumpled in like a piece of paper. And there's mortar on the bars. So it was in place at the time of the explosion. Blast tore it from the wall. Bits of pipe clear Poor over thing. here. Must have been one powerful blast. Yeah. Edges curled out. Something inside blew it wide open. Wall too. Hmm. Bathhouse drain pipes seem to converge here. No traces of magic. This was no spell. It was a bomb. Shouldn't go wide without taking any of it. Get in the to breathe. Drowners. Of course. Ah! Alright, let me use the pop's antidote now. Uh, where was it? Is this it? Perfume. Where did it go? Oils. Other. These can be exchanged for uh, regular crowns. Perfume, paint. Crafting. I would figure that it's right here. Ah, uh, is this a no, white honey, swallow, cat, thunderbolt, well then... Oh, it was bombs. Food and drink. Honey, onion, bread, goat's milk. Egg, fish, grapes. That, that. No, 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 no. Or maybe I can just keep on running. Okay, chill. Oh my god. 
Ow. Uh, I thought witchers' potions were vile. Oh. Wait, I equipped it apparently. <laughs> this entire time I was looking for it, but I already had it equipped. Cool. That's great. Keep staying, uh... Keep that regeneration coming. Looks like there might be something over here. Possibly. Maybe not. Wants me to search, aha. Uh, huh. Bottom of a container. Silver silver Search room like for evidence. Rooms etched in the bottom. It's warped, probably by the explosion. Bomb part. Must be. Smells like wyvern oil and caramel. That'd be it down here. Time to see Dijkstra. Gold coin. Trail ends here. Dandelion must have loaded the treasure onto a boat. Would you look at that? Help! Save me! I'm dying of poverty. I'm dying of poverty. Ah! <laughs> Turn to the bathhouse. Oh, nice. I see which way you went. Explain everything that happened. Found the piece of the bomb. Seems to me a bomb blew the wall open. Look. Bottom of a silver cylinder, probably. Covered in runes. Interesting. Any oh. idea what it contained? Recognized some ingredients by their scent. Wyvern oil and sugar. Sugar? Geralt, I'm in no Sugar. mood for jests. It wasn't a jest. Nor am I. Just saying what I found. Bomb contained sugar. Let's think. Sugar would react violently with sulfuric acid, but not so violently to cause an explosion. Didn't know you were versed in alchemy. Dabbled in it a bit, while at Oxenford Academy. <laughs> but this is no time to reminisce. You're to find my treasure, not write my biography. Know anything else about this bomb? Anything at all? Bomb was inside a pipe. Bomb went off inside a drainage pipe embedded in the vault wall. But the grate at the end of the pipe was in place when the blast happened. Meaning... The bomb must have found its way into the pipe from inside the bathhouse. Exactly. Might have gone something like this. Perpetrator started emptying one of the pools, then dropped the bomb down the drain. The bomb flowed down with a runoff, came to rest on the grate, and, to quote Bart, big boom. <laughs> See which drain they drain dropped the pipes pipe are only promising lead. The bomb we down. just need to know which pool it's connected to. Yes. Atom keeps a record of guests. Should be able to tell us who used that pool the day of the break-in. You've not done badly. Feel hey. honored to be acknowledged. Oh, wow. that famous sarcasm. I missed it. Really? Hmm. About as much as I'd miss a knife in me knickers. Huh. <laughs> Aha. Good one, mate. <laughs> Alright. 
You inspect the pools on the right, I'll take the ones on the left. Holler if you find anything. Alright, let's put them uh, Witcher sensors to test. Nothing Damn interesting. It. Nothing interesting. Same. Tiles falling. Something floating on the surface. Yes, yeah, some wood. Oil looks like. Oh, oil. Ah. Yep. Here we are. Silver lid. Matches the cylinder bottom I found in the sewer. Dijkstra, come here. Isn't this just going to lead to dandelion? That, uh, well, I mean... Maybe it can help us Ghost find him. Yeah. But not his treasure. Part. Happen. Drain pool four. And bring me the guest book. Chop, chop. Chop, chop. Let's see what's on the bottom. Let's see what's on the bottom. Grate's been removed from the drain, meaning they flushed the bomb down here. Happen. Hmm. Who used this pool the day of the break-in? Let me see. Uh, Bertolt Heinz, town councilman, Josef Schweik, brewer, and Margrave Henkel. Henkel? That's impossible. Who's that? Margrave Henkel. Who's that? Who was that, you mean? Old Coach been eating dirt since last winter. Couldn't have been here the day of the break-in. He's dead. I'd not heard. Not surprising. The Honorable Margaret Yeah, what up, living legend? How you doing? Decked out in leather lingerie, so the family held a hush-hush funeral. But I have my sources. Yeah. Yeah, I saw him that fateful day, Mr. Reuven. I'm certain of it. Did you speak to him? Hmm. Get a good look at him? No. He merely passed by on the way in. So you didn't see Henkel. You saw an impersonator. Think for once. They scooped out your balls, not your brain. And you, Geralt, start looking into this. Where do I start? Fine. Where should I start? Henkel's home. Derelict townhouse south of the main square. You might happen on some trace of this scoundrel we're looking for there. Well, off with you. Alright, alright. Yeah, I guess I, I would be hasty too if I lost all that money. To Henkel's house. Doing great. Today's my birthday. Yo, dude, happy birthday. That's awesome. I hope you have a good birthday and I hope you uh get some stuff that you're looking for. Doing absolutely nothing today. <laughs> that's that's never a bad thing though. Especially on your birthday. Looks more like a beggar's hovel than a Margrave's townhouse. Dandelion made some interesting friends. <laughs> I'm naked. Okay. I'm trying to find a way inside here. Have you been playing any games recently, Legend? No, you gotta take risks. Anything good at all? Oh, can I push this? I can. Uh, hard, right? Yep. Robbery nice. Robbery in broad daylight. Thank you. One thing I want to do is sold out again. It sells as fast. What's that? A letter and a bottle. Message in a bottle. More footsteps. Ah, and there's a wall. Loot, loot, damn no wine from your birth here. It's absolutely excellent. Oh, uh, the Oculus Starting Quest. Okay. Oof. You absolutely yeah. must try it. But afterwards, please place the bottle back where you found it. Your birth year. 
Aha. Could be dandelions. It's gotta or be series. right there. 1245 to 1254. Hmm. Satisfying click. In the next room over, I think. Talks out loud a lot. <laughs> I mean, I guess I, I can't judge because so do I. But I'm also streaming. Room. Otherwise, I wouldn't Stay be talking out loud. And his heist. Damn, that sucks, though, man. Hopefully, one day. One day it won't be. Siri, Menge is following me. Part of me kind of wishes treasure. I got the yes, quest, the but you must flee. I like my rift. At the same time, footsteps, not good. If I ever come into a good amount of extra money, though, or if, like it goes on like a really good sale, I would definitely pick up the quest. Though that would be so cool to have. Instructions on how to build a bomb, signed by one Kelkstein. Sugar, and lumps of a substance dipped in wyvern oil. Hmm. Potassium? Hmm. Looks like they made the bomb here. Alright, check what's going on downstairs. Ah! Friendos. Didn't expect to see you here. Certainly not with Triss. I decided we could use someone who knows a bit of magic. The runes on the bomb, I'm absolutely dying to know what they mean. You dying to know too, Triss? No, just here for the coin. <laughs> ah, Marigold playing the cynical materialist. I love it. In truth, her ideals brought Triss here. She needs gold to save her colleagues. When I recover my treasure, I'll be in a position to help her. Simple as that. Speaking of which, and pardon my Beauchelet was. Have you found out who fucking nicked my gold? Uh... Bothered Triss for nothing. No point examining the bomb. Because? Because I already know who nabbed your treasure. Commander of the Temple Guard, Caleb Menge. Well, well, Marigold. Your coin stands to come with a side of revenge. Geralt, would you be kind enough to tell me what you've learned? I'm terribly curious. Our grave Hankel told me everything. Hankel told me. Old man's alive and well. Faked his own death to escape his creditors. Strange. I had no idea he was in debt. He was. And Menga promised to take care of things in exchange for help with the heist. So... Geralt, how can I put this delicately? Bollocks. If you thought I'd fall for that tale you just pulled out of your ass, you don't know me one bit. Know you well enough to know what matters. Results. So I lied. Still say I can lead you to your treasure. Forgive me, Geralt, but after what you just pulled, I'd sooner believe a whore who proclaimed her undying love. <laughs> Would you believe a sorceress who stands to gain if you get your coin back? Perhaps. I'd still prefer the whore, though. <laughs> You're hiding something. And that's one thing I can't stand. Even more than Nilfgaard. But ultimately, this is a business deal, not a marriage. Besides, there must be some truth in all those lies. You're too dense to make it all up on your own. Hmm. Menger has been spending heaps of coin lately. Though to my knowledge, he shouldn't have a copper to his name. So, what now? From what I've heard, Menger spends his nights at the docks, witch hunter's quarters. Maybe pay him a visit. Ask where he's holding my gold for me. All right. Doubt Menger will admit anything willingly. As do I. Lucky I hired a witcher and a sorceress who've been through so much together to get this done. What's our past got to do with it? A great deal. Lovers will jump into the abyss for one another. Suits my needs perfectly. Namely, it greatly increases your chances of getting out of the hunter's barracks alive with my treasure. Trist and I, that's all in the past. Information's out of date. We are not. Yes, I know. You parted a week after the summit of Loch Muin, in the woods near where the Lixella flows into the Pontar. But you know what they say. Old love never dies. First, first love. 
Now, how the hell? <laughs> That's my secret, lovebirds. Really must be going. Good luck. Didn't have to disagree so strongly. Put yourself in my shoes. What would you have said? In your shoes, I wouldn't be worrying about what to say to Dijkstra. At all. But we've strayed from our topic. Got a treasure to recover. Triss, gotta tell you something. Dijkstra's gold, it's the last thing I care about. Thought as much. This is about Siri, isn't it? Mm hmm Menga's got Dandelion locked up somewhere, and Dandelion saw Siri. That changes everything. Listen, meet me at midnight by the Chapel of the Eternal hey. Fire, east of the harbor. We'll figure out a way to get into the Hunter's Barracks together. All right, see you then, and thanks. Sounds good. Meet her at the Eternal Fire Shine near the harbor around midnight. Alright, so we'll head there and then probably, I guess, just uh, meditate until midnight. Uh, before we do that, I'm going to go ahead and run to the bathroom and grab some more water. So I will be right back in just... back so we need to meet her here around midnight so let's go ahead and meditate until how does this work just click 12 a.m perfect perfecto Another game I want to play. Glad you're here. Mafia Listen, one and two. Took a look at the building and it does not look good. I mean, it, it would be my third playthrough. Well, actually, I mean, almost like fourth playthrough of Mafia High two. Walls, guards at the if gate, I do armed it. Men everywhere. We could never sneak in, and fighting our way in won't work. Menga would have had plenty of time to escape. What do you suggest? Take these shackles. Put them on me. Hmm. Well, all right. Uh, -huh. uh Triss, sure you want to do this? Out here, with everyone watching. This might come <laughs> as a surprise to you, but shackles do have uses outside of the bedroom. <laughs> Think. Bring the hunters the vile that Triss was perfect. Marigold. They won't just open the gate for you. They're likely to let you present her to Menga personally. No way. <clears throat> Too risky. Dandelion's life's on the line. Series 2. No such thing is too risky. All right. Fine. Let's say they take the bait. What then? We go in, I put a sword to Menga's throat and ask him where Dandelion is? Might not work. Menga's scum, but you have to admit, death doesn't scare him. Always found that annoying in fanatics. So we gotta trick him into talking. Any ideas? Maybe tell him you have information about the Lodge. Or about Philippa. Even better, he hates her most of all. You'll think of something. Alright, let's go. Still got a bad feeling about this. But tough. Let's go. <laughs> I love that response that he, that he had to her. Sure you want to do this remember, right here, right myself. now, in front of everybody? What are you talking about? The hunters. <laughs> they won't treat me like a lady, but I'll survive. Might hurt a bit, but... Siri, she's what matters. Do what you need to do, no matter what happens. Can't promise that. I'm still asking you to, all right? Hmm, all right. Hmm, all right. Very well, very well. Shall but we must What do you want? 
Here for my reward. Well, the Alpha. For a witch. Recognize who I got? It's Triss Marigold. Marigold? Come in then. Come in then. Right too. Well, well. Triss Marigold. Giving up drowners for sorceresses. Pays better. It's cause they do more harm. What's a drowner do? Pull the odd fisherman from his boat, but the witches? They murder kings, scheme, start wars. Don't forget turning your cow's milk sour straight out of the udder. Ah! You're done jesting, Marigold. How dare for you? good. Put her in a cell. Not so fast. I hand her over to Menga himself, or not at all. You reckon we don't know what to do with this witch? Let go, you bastard! Vulgar tongue's got no place being in such a pretty mouth. I guess we'll have to rip it out. I know you're witches, but you're shit at catching them. Got something to offer me. Try to loosen it if I were you. Might learn something interesting. For instance? For instance, where Philippa Eilhart's hiding. I'll get you for this, you- Shut your gob, ginger whore! And you spit it out! Where's Eilhart? Thought I made myself clear. I'll only talk to Menga. Menga don't talk to the likes of you. Well, then you be sure to tell him I came by. With my friend Marigold. Fine, grab her and come with me. But be sure to stay right close. There we go. <laughs> Just walk right over the barrel. Uh, he's not going to. Ah, <laughs> uh, just what I thought. Something that once was a. Uh, Here's where we split up. Go see Menga. Basically, a call. <laughs> But I was you trying can't to say. have her until I get. You don't set the terms here, Dirk. You know what to do. You won't get a word out of me. Not you. Not him. Oh, play it tough, eh? Just you wait. We'll take a fingernail or three. That ought to get you singing. Fine, take her. Fine, but no Fine, torture. take her. I'd rather she didn't interrupt my conversation. But hands off, don't touch her. Why? Feel sorry for the bitch. No, couldn't give a shit about her. But if I don't get what I want from Menga, I'll want to sell her to someone else. Don't want you damaging the goods. Keen nose for enterprise. You'd make a great madam. Don't you worry. Menga will give you your coin, and Marigold will get what she deserves. No torture till I get there. Got it? Got it. No torture. What? The Horson's casting spells. Get him! Ah, oh, shit. Alive. Take him alive. Whoops. Oh, that was a mistake. That's enough of that. Oh, oh, oh man! Holy crap! Spread out! He just exploded. Come here, you. Damn. Oh, shoot. Ah! Oh, God. 
Joe, can't we just talk this out, man? My guy? have it well and that was a lot more rough than I was hoping it would be but that's all right I would say they got what they would they deserved kill the witch hunters you'll burn Off with your legs. <laughs> Jeez. I think that's all of them. That was close. Axie in a crowd? Geralt, there was no way that could work. Sorry. I couldn't let them torture you. You mean too much to me. Oh. We should search the office. Maybe we can find some documents mentioning Dandelion. I'll search his body. You search the room. I'd start with the desk. Very well. Oh, would you look at that? Find anything? Just his office key in his pockets. Here. Nothing under his belt. Wait. Something sewn in the lining. What is it? The key to a vault. Here. Give it to Dijkstra with my regards. Aha. Found the letter from a spy. I found a letter to Menga from someone important. A spy, I think. A spy? Take a look. Drop boxes, secret signals. Yeah, strong stench of spycraft here. This agent could know more about Dandelion. Bet he does. Letter explains how to signal for a meeting. No mention of where it would take place. Maybe Dijkstra can help. He knows everything. Everything? Slight exaggeration there. I'm not so sure. Kinda doubt the key will be enough. Key to a vault? No address? Why do I doubt this'll make Dijkstra smile? Well, might keep him from setting his thugs on us. Breaking our legs for failing to fulfill our part of the bargain. Meaning glass is half full? Of something strong, I hope. Let's get going. Alright. Nothing left for us here. Let's go. Be glad to. Just not by way of the main gate. Hey. This is where Not we bad. split up. But first, let's burn this shack down. Agreed. We've left too much evidence. Yeah, but I also need to blow off some steam. Listen, there's one other thing I wanted to talk about. But not here, and definitely not now. Come by later when you have a moment? I'd appreciate it. All right. We need to get out of here. Hmm. What could that be? Is the entire place going to burn? I guess so. Jump onto the roof. Nice. All right, we'll go tell Extra what we learned. 
Uh, okay. Yeah. Hard. Uh oh. You What's this? There. Mr. Roven wants a word. Impatient old bastard. What? Nothing. Be there soon. There he is. Who do I spy? Why, it's Geralt of Rivia. <laughs> <sighs> will you stop following me already? I will, as soon as you tell me where my treasure is. Me and Menga didn't see eye to eye. How badly? Badly. I suppose that explains the smoke. My treasure's not in there, is it? Burning with the witch hunters. Didn't see it anywhere, and 20 tons of gold is hard to this miss. This happened. You mean to say you've come to me empty handed? <laughs> somebody off, just died? You came to me. Second, I do have something in my hand the key to a vault, found it on Menge. A vault? It even that disappears. I need to find on my own. You've not made things much easier for me. Give me that. That's it. That's all you're gonna Dude, say. somebody is fighting. No wry remark. Who is no fighting? Scintillating joke. <laughs> you want a knee slapper? Fine, I'll tell you one. Ready? You lied to me again. What? You knew what is from going the start on? You robbed me, but you didn't deign to share that information with me. I'm crying. You'll get the treasure back, won't you? No, I didn't. But I did deign to help you find your treasure. So stop moaning. I jest you not, Geralt. You abused my trust. I can live with that. This time, yes, you'll live. And now, time to settle things. That a threat? Quite the contrary. You helped me, Witcher. So in spite of everything, you've earned your reward. I take it you've still no idea what happened to Dandelion? None. Found someone who might know, though. A spy, I guess. Signs his name, Yammerlack. Found a letter of his. Just one problem. It only details how to arrange a meeting with him. Makes no mention of where. A ruined house in far corners. Give the signal, and he'll show up there the same day, just before midnight. Thank you for your help. Thanks for your help. No need to thank me. Just paying off a debt. I always do, you know. Even to liars. And a final humble plea. Don't try to fool me again. Ever. Fair enough. Also, okay, so what's been going on up here? Because, uh. Oh. <laughs> I guess he knocked out that guy? It's 4 a.m. Uh, find the box using the Witcher senses. Oh, man! Some of these parts in this city reminds me of, uh, my playthrough of Kingdom Come Deliverance. I always wanted to go back to that game and play all the DLC. I know the game ended so abruptly, but it was still, like, a lot of fun at the time. Oh! Oh! I don't know if I'll ever return to it though. I mean, if like all the DLC is super cheap one day, then maybe. I know the one DLC, uh, it lets you like take over a city. You became the bard of a city, which was pretty cool. But. Find the drop box using Witcher senses. Place the holy tome where the signal, there to signal that you want to meet with the spy. Okay. Must be the drop oh, box. Here it is. The signal. Spies should show up in far corners before midnight. Okay. Meet at their arranged meeting place at midnight. Or be at the. I haven't used Roach in so long. Uh, if this guy is here. I'm gonna try selling some stuff to him real quick. Oh no. 
It's a bandit corner. Save real quick. What is this? Uh, smuggler's cash. It's gonna be hidden there. Okay. Run in, run in, man, run in, run in, man, run in, run in. Is there a, a closer point? Nope. That's all right. We're practically there. And then now it's 4.30 a.m. So we're just going to have to uh, meditate until midnight, I guess. Now just to hide and wait. Is there a place you can hide in here? Behind the door. Best place to hide. Classic. All right, time to wait. <laughs> Let's go ahead and do this. Can you go the opposite way? Oh, nice, you can. Let's wait until midnight. And there we are. Imagine showing up at a place what? Her? Triss, how do you know to... Ah, Dijkstra, huh? None other. I couldn't resist. Really want to see this through to the end. Perfect place for a tryst. With Triss. Mm-hmm. Ceilings collapsed, mold on the walls, mouse droppings in the corner. Lips almost pucker on their own. <laughs> He's coming, hide. Manga. Indisposed. Very indisposed. I don't know who you are, but you're in deep. Shit right up to your nostrils. You're in deeper, I assure you. But answer our questions and we'll help you get out. The answer to each question will be the same. Sod off. It's no way to talk to a lady. That's no way to talk to a lady. To a lady, I've never but to a witch. You can. Wouldn't recommend it, though. <laughs> Had enough? <laughs> Fuck off. I can take this. Of course Turn you Turn it can. up. But I'm just getting started. <laughs> you must be thinking, this can't possibly hurt any worse. Oh, it can. So, can I talk? Uh, yes! Yes! Just tell me what the fuck about! <laughs> We're looking for Dandelion. We know Menka captured him. Right. That's what this is all about. A fucking minstrel! You might have set up at the start, before your body started mucking my mind with magic. I, I can't believe it. For a miserable sap like that. Get to the point. The dandelion is on Temple Isle. In the dungeon beneath the shrine. Menger's planning to execute him in auction first. Positively spectacular. Afraid you'll have to call off the show. How can we free Dandelion? Those who leave Temple Isle do so only on Menke's orders. Issued in person. Damn it. Hmm. We'll find a way. I have an idea. Tell you later. Alright, enough. We've learned everything we wanted to. <sighs> Glad to hear it. Can I assume we can put this unfortunate incident behind us and... Not so fast. Geralt. I know. He's seen too much. Why? I told you. I'll never. 
Either he dies, or I wipe his mind. Take his memory. Strip him of his memory. But, but I helped you. I helped. It's not so bad. I promise. Peace. Lay showed your claws today. Really showed you claws today. Is that how you see it? Oh my god. I put it differently. I showed how little I differ from these bastards. I let's finish up and leave. I want to go home, bathe, and get drunk. Said you had an idea about freeing Dandelion. Yes. We know he's on the island. And he'll stay there until Manga orders him transferred to Oxenford, right? Mm-hmm. Problem is, Manga's dead. So... No one else knows that. He could have escaped the fire. He could reappear. Him or someone very, very similar. A Doppler? Mm-hmm. Your old friend, Dudu Biberveld, impersonated the halfling merchant. Dandelion claimed he seemed more real than the original. So much so, Vivaldi gave him a loan of several thousand crowns without batting an eye. Yeah, except Dudu's in hiding right now. Priscilla might know something, though. Fingers crossed. Listen, there's one other thing I wanted to talk about, but not here. Oh my god, she keeps saying right that. Now. Come by later when you have a moment. I'd appreciate it. All right. We need to get out of here. She literally has said that like four times now. Should I just go? <laughs> she keeps saying, come by later. There's something I want to talk about. It's like, okay. 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 <laughs> uh, let me actually check my quest. Is there one for her? Meet her setter. Matter of life and death. Ping, blah blah blah. I mean, I'll put this to your friend. She did not to hesitate to ask. Is there another one that's like meet up with her? Well, it's from Yundivik. Where's that at? Man. We are in, we've been in Navi, Navigrad for so long now. Okay. I'm going to go to square. Here we are. Tell Priscilla what you've learned about Dudu. What a name. <laughs> I wish there was a, a faster way to get to her. This right room? Nope. This one. Uh, there she is. Think I know how to free Dandelion. Got a plan, but we need Dudu. Gotta find him. This pep Our Doppler friend was... Brilliant. You're his friend. With a dop in the pup. Alright, just tell me where Dudu's at. We need... Dandy. So we look. Yes. Hmm. We need a... May... Not a bad... Bizarre. It must be... Oh. Any idea... Actually, I would. The key is to convince the message. Uh, just, uh, more or less. More or less. That'll do. Now to perhaps. And the Doppler who manages, who in turn is. 
Good idea. Sounds good. Really think I've got it. But at uh, which <laughs> it's a good we title. A good I have some idea. Gonna consider. Of course. This is building the play to bring him out. Doppler salvation. Yeah. Let's go with just one prop. Nothing simpler. Mm. I was thinking more. Comedy. Think. Very well. Fine. Geralt. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. <sighs> Done. I could make a small masterpiece of this had I a bit more time, but we're fresh out of that. The hidden message to Dudu. What did you weave in? Hidden message? You were gonna work something in, like come to the Kingfisher at dawn, or that wouldn't be in keeping with the tone of the play, not at all. Ow. You wrote it to <laughs> contact Dudu. That was the purpose. Fine. So how do you see this working? I don't know. I was counting on recognizing him by his scar. Or just improvising. Shall we worry about that later? First, you must take the script to Madame Irina. Sure you know where to find her? The troop performs in the butcher's yard off the main square. Join us later. See ya. Take the script to your own... Oh my gosh. It's in, yeah, it's inside there. Where are you going? That's a place. It Can I get in there? This where Madame Arena's troop. Yeah, but you can only. Sir. No perform. You can still get. Need it. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Here. Thank you. There you are. Madame Arena. Geralt, is he with you? No, but. Hmm. How can I help? We've not seen Dandelion or Doodoo recently. Put on a play. On a stage a play. Something that'll really draw the crowds. I see. And you hope it'll get Doodoo's attention as well, draw him here. So it must be an entirely new play? And who will write it? Priscilla actually. You've already had somebody write it. it. Tells the story of a witcher who rescues a Doppler from certain death. Mm. Sounds interesting. I'll gladly have a glance. But first, we must think about getting the word out and organizing some protection. Ushers. Would you mind tending to these matters? Sure, I guess. How can I help you spread the word about the premiere? Well, we'd like all the city to hear about it, so we must clearly talk to the Puffins. Who are the Puffins? Street artists. Get them to announce the premiere, and even the muscles on the harbor piling will hear about it. Where'll I find them? They did occupy some rooms in the bits in a townhouse, but I can't be sure they're still there. I've not seen them in the streets lately. They may very well have hung up their body hose. Let's see if I can find them, and if they'll work for us. Why the ushers? Think we need ushers? Can't be sure if you've attended many performances, but no- Rotten apple. Axe. Alright. Try the d Alright, I'll go find them. Thanks. See you then. They recruit jugglers from the performing troop. All the puffins. Cursed mage uh, yeah, they're close. Might as well. Ah. Oh! Did you see those poor wretches? <laughs> this one says it's optional, but it's so close. Given me no choice. Nice. Didn't even have to pull out my sword.
Nice tune. Damn sad, though. Then it successfully conveys my mood. What do you seek here? Looking for the puffins. Looking for the puffins. Have I found them? We've no coin. Leave us be. How about I give Think you some? Been a mistake. Sorry. Thought our landlord had hired another thug to collect from us. Got a job for you. Don't want any coin from you. In fact, I'm willing to pay you, provided you agree to get the word out about Madame Arena's new play. Oh, afraid that's impossible. Ever since we premiered our fateful ballad about Holy Hemelfart, who his faith ignores, gorges himself, diddles old whores, Fatso's gang has been harassing us incessantly. Mm. Fatso's gang? Common thugs and the church's pay. City's full of gangs like that now. They threaten me, sir. Said they round off her pointy ears with a carving knife. They don't let us perform. Chase away spectators, destroy our instruments. Lately they've taken to lurking outside our home. We're at wit's end, no clue what to do. All right. Say I get Fatso and his boys to leave you alone. Will you publicize Arena's play then? Of course. I'm not a great... Ugh. Get rid of the thugs. Okay, well, they're right here. I dare you to say it again. Hey, yo. Leave them alone. So you're the ones. Oh, I thought so. Look who we got here. Is it just me, or you got cat eyes? Right, he does. Straight cat must have fucked his mum. <laughs> now, what you doing in the city of eternal fire, cat shit? Leave the puffins alone. Worms that insulted Iraq Emilfart, called him an allmonger. I'd sooner snuff out the holy flame itself. <laughs> Tell them fucking poets to come down here. Shove their fruits up their blaspheming assholes. Yeah, to play a different tune then, every time they fought. <laughs> Leave the puffins alone. Aye, we will. Alone. What the hell? Black magic! <laughs> He's a fucking witch! Get him! I don't like it when I do that. Damn it enough. <laughs> we kill one guy and he's like, alright, enough, enough. Ah, oh, what a sight! You really showed him. One, two over the back, then pow right in the noggin. I'll finally be able to leave my home without hiding beneath the hood. Thank you very much. Come on, it was nothing. Oh, it was something alright. I don't dare think we've forgotten our promise. We'll strip our voices ragged praising Arena's new play. How much will I owe you? Not a copper. Helped us out. See no reason why we shouldn't help you. Get half of town to come to the play. Wait and see. Some quick preparations and we'll be out in the streets. <laughs> Till the next. Nice. Clear the eternal fire. I mean, honestly, I have enough coin where I would, I would pay them. Seemed like a nice bunch, too. Uh, where is our next stop? It's over there. I can cross the bridge and then fast travel. That works for me. Um, is it, it's one, two, three, four. <laughs> Perfect. Okay, let's go to Navigrad Docks. And hire ushers for the play. Okay. Who do I talk to? Solus the Bell? Good fight. Some nice footwork there. Challenging me, or is it hell you want to face? A witcher versus the beast of Metina. Killer instinct versus primal rage. Got a job for you. I'd like to hire you to help out. We're staging a play. Need us to kick some ass on stage. Actually want you to usher. 
Keep the peace. Make sure no one's ass gets kicked, on stage or off. Got the wrong men. Ass kicking's what we do. I pay well. Stand to make more than you do here. Expecting trouble? Will we need to bust some heads? Can't rule it out. Bricks could start flying. Heard that from a reliable source. Ow! Wanna smash some bricklayers? Oh, he does, he does! <laughs> oh, I don't know my own brother. Give me that coin. And don't fret. We'll be there before any of the uh, dancing starts. Nice. Looks like they they are all set now. Go back to the uh, play area. Fast travel over there, hopefully. Yep, nice. Use Quen to get rid of critical effects like burning, bleeding, etc. Huh, I didn't actually know that. Does it save you from... I wonder when we went into that sewer and we used that potion. If uh, Quen could have saved us from getting damage or taking damage from that. Okay. I'm back here. There she is. Arena, you're just about all ready. Managed to hire some ushers. Wonderful. That's one matter resolved. Wanted to talk about the text itself. Hmm. It's not at all badly written. In fact, I quite like it. I was willing to relax my standards to help Dudu, but we may have something very interesting here. I've very clear ideas who to cast as the servant, the witcher, and the queen, but I'm not certain who should play the prince and the princess. Uh, who's going to play the witcher? Who's playing the witcher? An amateur. It'll be my first time working with him, but I'm confident he'll pull it off. Newcomer to the troupe? In a sense. Oh, stop pretending you don't know. I'm talking about you. Oh. <laughs> good idea. It's a good idea. Doubt I'll get a standing ovation, but Dudu will see me. That's the key. But you will make an effort, won't you? Learn your lines, at least. I'll give it a shot, of course. Er. Sure. All right, the princess. So, about the princess. Small part, but an important one. Any idea who could play her? Priscilla would be the obvious choice. She's young and beautiful. Yet, I do have more stage experience. Uh... You should play a princess. Role's yours. Talent and experience trump looks in my book. I'm honored. I shall give it my all. All right, and so the who prince. Do you see playing the Doppler Prince? I'm finding it hard to decide between two candidates. Abelard Ritzer would be the safer bet. He's been part of our troupe for ages, has flawless technique, but he doesn't exactly captivate the crowds. Who's your other option? Maxim Bolia, outstanding actor, and audiences love him, but sadly, I can never be sure he'll show up sober, or that he'll show up at all. Uh, shoot. We gotta go with somebody that at least show order. up. I'll take a reliable artisan over an unpredictable artist any day. Rightly so. The project is risky enough without our casting Maxim. Alright, got the cast figured out. Alright, got the cast figured out. <laughs> it seems so. Prepared to plunge headlong into your career as a mama? We can start now. We can start now. Looked over the script out of curiosity. We can start any time, even now. Well, we've no time to lose. Come to the stage. Zoltan, what are you doing here? <laughs> Pressy told me you ought to put on a play. Were you playing the lead? I'm not the lead. Oh, I thought to myself, I'd sooner shave my beard than miss that. Tell me, Witcher, you gonna wear hose and a codpiece? Mm -hmm. Calm, Geralt. You must focus your mind before you go on stage. Good luck. Okay. 
Ladies and gentlemen, most honorable citizens of the hallowed city of Novigrad, welcome. We have for you an exquisite comedy. It's exquisite. Title, the Doppler's Salvation. The players, which Geralt as himself, Katarina as the queen, Leo Ribe as the humble servant, appearing as the prince, a veteran of the Novigrad stage, Abelard Ritza. And as the princess, renowned artiste, beloved queen of the stage, Irina Reynard. Nice. Give cat. Majesty, the monster slayer awaits. Your summons he's answered and stands at the gates. Show him in. I must speak to the man. But first, some wine to steady my hand. <laughs> Witcher, your task is a matter most tender. Her monster shall show a tonight's feastly splendor. Stand guard, beware, kill the beast if he shows. Your reward you'll receive on my finest pillows. To slay beasts most foul. Was for this I was made. I kill as my calling, not just to get paid. Nothing. <laughs> he swallowed the bait, this fool of a witcher. I'll ensure the foul bow reveals his true figure. The monster revealed, the witcher shall strike. The beast will he slay, thrust his head on a pike. Oh! My child will pity her love, this beast. Though at least, ere he goes, he'll enjoy a last feast. Is this supposed to get silent like that? Huh. Act Gathered two. are we, a host fair and noble, to celebrate this day the princess's betrothal. Alas, no monster do I see or hear. Perhaps midst the guests he hides, in fear. <gasps> My dear, long have we hid our love's tender fires. Months we've restrained our loins' hot desires. Tonight shall it end. Be my wife, that's my plea. That having said, <laughs> I'll get down on my knee. Oh, darling, I will, I will, I will. Wait, with wine must we toast this moment joyful. If not, a foul curse shall rend your lives woeful. T -t 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 Treason! Tis not wine, <laughs> but a brew spiked with silver. <gasps> My bowels contract a foul beast to deliver. <laughs> hark, hark. Tis no prince, but a Doppler imposter. If the maid loves him, it seems we've lost her. Behold, Witcher, the beast of which I spoke. Unleash your sword. Let fly the killing stroke. Stop. Stop. Beast or man, tis my love, my betrothed. Sheath your blades, fear a doppler. Tis a thing most foolish. Changing one's shape does not make one ghoulish. Remember, tis not flesh a monster makes. But a lack of morals and a surfeit of cakes. <coughs> Witcher, tis true. <laughs> like, it's so this bad. foul suspicions. 
tainted my mind with this plan so malicious. The Doppler must live. My daughter he'll wed. Beast or man, she loves him truly without dread. Tis our tale's end, good folk. And its moral is this. No monster is he whose shape can shift. The Witcher is just a true Doppler's friend. But you, foul page, in chains you shall end. God! Call the God! Remove the traitor at once! Hey, hear the princess's command. Come up here. Come on then, governor. Up you go. On stage. Toss the tray, I'll scum in the dungeon. <laughs> Don't be afraid. In the end, everyone will live happily ever after. Cameo. Doppler and Princess wed the same night. The servant's heart melted. He wept at the sight. Doppler's to the stake! Burn them all! Give it a rest, mate. Can't you see it's all in fun? This is a comedy. A ghoul could play the prince. Light it up, for God's sake. <laughs> <laughs> One guy starts clapping at everybody. Well, I guess we'll all clap now. <laughs> Geralt's like, oh, yeah, I could do this every day. Wasn't so bad. Geralt, you recognized me. How'd you do it? Greetings, Dudu. Heard about that souvenir Horson left on your face. So... You know everything? Have you seen Siri? No. Still looking for her. Geralt! Masterful! You did great. Haven't they laughed that hard in ages? <laughs> Lads won't believe it when I tell them. Explain one thing to me. How do you and Dandelion manage to displease Reuven, Horson, and the Temple Guard all at the same time? It's not as if we planned it. <laughs> <laughs> How'd you escape after the fight? I know Siri went back to Horsons to get you. How'd you manage to escape? I ran after her, wanting to keep up, but I'd have been a hindrance. She called out to me, entreated me to shapeshift and disappear. I tried to find them, Siri and Dandelion. It was as if they turned to vapor. Fearing for my life, I shifted each day, becoming someone else. Even considered turning into Siri to trick her pursuers, but. Slow down, Marmalade. Oh, wow. Hmm. Final Fantasy VII Remake just got pushed Cinderella. back, too. Hmm? Wow. Been a while, hasn't it? Two a games while. pushed back yeah. today. For me, likewise. Must be a full grown lass by now. Do, do, do us a wee favor. Show us silly for a moment. Geralt? Uh, sure. Transform. Go. Change into her. Oof. I feel strange. Both of you staring at me bug eyed. Is that enough? Yeah, plenty. Bad idea. Not angry with me, are you, Geralt? Nah. No. Ever. I feel relieved. And Dandelion? Were you able to find him? Witch hunters nabbed him, but there's good news too. We think we can free Dandelion. Just need your help. What could I do? Take on Menga's appearance, then go and give the order for Dandelion to be moved to Oxenfurt. We'll lie in ambush in a ravine en route. Spring dandelion from the convoy when it rolls by. Wait, not so fast. 
How am I to be Menga? And I've no notion where Dandelion's being held. You'll be fine. Listen, you'll manage. Everybody believes Menga's missing. You can make up any story you want. My lads and me will lie in ambush in the ravine. Geralt will then join us and we'll await word from you. But how am I to contact you as Menga? Send word that the convoy's left. You'll need to figure that out. Come on, Kyle's your middle name. So, we all clear? Dudu, get your ass to Temple Isle. I'm off to assemble my crew. And we'll be waiting for you, Geralt. Yeah, see you in the ravine. Whoa, wait! Hold on! What happens after? I, I hope you don't expect me to continue as Menga, live like Chappelle, burning the occasional heretic to keep up appearances? <laughs> no. Once it's over, we expect to see you at the Rosemary in time, where we'll all meet. To get pissed like wild badgers. So, settled? Let's get to work. All of this Not just bad. for Dan. Not bad at all for your first time out. Just a few minor trip ups. <laughs> the performance in general. What did you think? I doubt the audience understood it all, but that's to be expected. I'm just pleased the puffins got the word out. That was quite the crowd. You were right to cast Abelard as the prince. It's likely Maxim would have shown up drunk as a fish or forgotten about the premiere altogether. Here you are. Your fee. I must admit your style of mumming, well, it's quite minimalist. Did you study anywhere? At Kaer Morhen. Minimum expression means maximum effect. Thanks for the coin. Take <laughs> care now. <laughs> minimum expression means maximum effect. Interesting. Meet Zoltan at the site of the ambush. All right. Well, right here is just about a perfect spot for me to go ahead and stop for 